Blackmail Engagement Pittsburgh. Share. Inspire. Connect. Stan Thompson, and I am the uh, Program Director for the Education Program at the Heinz Endowments. My hopes for my community are twofold. Um, number one, that uh, we would learn how to um, respect the diversity that we have amongst ourselves and, and use that as an opportunity to, um, to support each other. The second thing that I'd like to see happen in our community is um, a focus on the part of our parents where um, many of them have been in the shadows uh, where their children's educations have been concerned. One of the things that I do to strengthen my community is um, I look for things that are happening uh, right under my nose and in, in my neighborhood, uh, whether it's talking to my neighbors um, about um, issues that their children are facing. I, I'm a former high school principal. Um, I'm someone who um, have, I, I have three of my own children. They're not children anymore. They're, they're young adults and have been uh, blessed to be in a situation where I've seen them go on to higher education. And just knowing the importance that um, parents can play in uh, supporting their children, not just as they're going through, uh, you know, their their um, intermediate uh, grades, primary, intermediate, and, and middle school years, but also through high school and through college. One of the challenges that uh, many of us have faced, because as I've talked with uh, with other uh, young African American males who are now, you know, certainly my age and, and older. Um, trying to find ourselves in a situation where we could get others who were the gatekeepers um, to those opportunities to believe in us. There are a lot of folks out there who are, you know, wanting to know that, hey, this is something that maybe I can do. I think sometimes People don't lack the ability to do things, but sometimes they may not have a dream or they may not have ideas. Truly, there are many things that you can do. Here's one thing you can add to the list, and that's, that's why I'm sharing this story.